Hello everyone, this is Alex here. Welcome to Let's Play Ocarina of Time. In the last video, you know, we did some stuff. In this video, we're actually going to get all the gold sodas and the last bean bin. I did it in a certain, I'm going to do it in a certain order. First of all, we're going to get the gold sodas we got. We still haven't got the yet. In fact, you know where it is. So we get my first bug. Okay, there are three gold sodas we got. And yeah. The first one is actually somewhere I actually forgot this whole time. See this this saucer right here? Right there. There's number one. So let's get the boats in there. And let's get our little Satoa. Oh shots right there. Let's go off. And get our token. There we go. And now, now, we still have some stuff to do. We will be going there today, though. Just not yet. So, yeah. Today we're going to the table of time. But first, we gotta get... Take care of this stuff we haven't done yet. So... Yep. We're almost done. We need to finish up stuff here. Then we should be ready to go to the table of time. Okay then, the next one is actually in Lake Halia. The reason why we're doing the Zora one first is because basically, you know why? Okay, I think I'll tell you why. That's right, there's a, actually a bean that we got in the Zango's Cavern, so it's easier to go that way. See, we're taking the long way to Lake Halia. So, on the way to Lakai, we're going to go to Zora's River to get the, the final magic bean. Because, since this is on the river, I can just take the long way or just climb up, but I want to show the intro to the place. So, just, let's show the intro. This one here. Zora's River. Yep, here we are. So, let's go down the river. Yep. Get some rubies on the way. Yeah, like, watch out for the Octa Rocks. And let's keep going. Alright, oh, that's really good. A lot of rubies in that river current. Wow, I'm so surprised. Yep. Anyway, let's talk to this guy again. Chomp, chomp, chomp. These are the super popular magic beans. In case you're wondering, they'll soon be sold out. That's right. Super price 60 rubies for one piece. Yes. Let's keep going. Let's put this magic bean, and there we go. Let's just go. Let's just get some stuff. Yeah, so we're still now. Yeah, there's only 10 of them. There's only 10 soft soils in the game. There's only 10 magic beans. Yeah, so that, that's then. Uh, let's go to the Lake Alia. And let's go to Lake Alia. Yeah. We also want to keep our bottle of bugs. Yep. Want to keep it very carefully. I want to check something very first. Wait, well, I can't check it. Guess not. I want to make sure. I think I probably have it. I also just can't believe this is our 41st Goza Sola. Yeah. Aw, oh, man. That's lame, but whatever. Let's we'll just keep going. We've got two more to go. We'll sort of bean bed. Yes, here we are. And maybe these a little bit interesting. Alright, there's the Rather Man right there. Yep. 
as I was saying, the main game is a little bit interesting. But we had distracted. Anyway, the main game is a little interesting, as I was saying. We were actually going to be going to go through Lake Halia. To there's, there's the main. Then goes Orange River. And then end up in the area known as Fury Reef Forest Lost Woods. Yep, we're going. Here's what we're going to do. After we finish up Lake Halia, we're actually going to go back to Kukiri Forest because we're actually going to go to the Dongos Cavern through Goron City. Why the Dongos Cavern? Did I say we're not going to do it until later? We'll get this. The last of Tiongo Stoving it for now is actually indeed inside the, the, the Dongos Cavern. Although there is one that we're going to get, but we're actually not going to get it until later on in the game. So, yeah. There's another one there, but same reasons why we're not going to get that one. Okay? Anyway, let's just go here, and there's a big one right there. Yeah, right here is Lake Halia's intro. Because I didn't show off yet. Anyway, see this right here? There is a thing right there. And, oh yeah, I already planted the magic beans, so, yeah. Get some stuff, because I want to get some more rupees. Yeah, because the fairy in the ball has to go pretty soon. Because there's a reason why I want to do that. That's where we're going to go to how custom to go to the potion shop to get that thing. I'm, I know, I'm going to waste a lot of rupees for that, but it's okay. Anyway, see the speed bed right here? Let's put it right here. Not even bed. Yeah. These are me beds. Get the boat. And let's just wait for the spirit to come out. There it is. There we go. There's another two again. Yay. Alright. So we're just going to go to back to, to the Donald's Cavern. Let's do that. Because we're just wasting time. And I already know what the song is. I think it was this. If there it is, there's a Scarecrow song. Yep, just wanted to make sure. Okay. Before we go, I want to say one thing. That island is dreaded. Be careful. Not really the top, it's actually, there's an entrance there, but that place is dreaded. So whatever you do, be careful when going there, because it's dreaded. Anyway, here we are back in the the main. I was just like there's a waterfall right there, and literally there's like no way you can actually just access the area. Like, there's like a waterfall right there, and then like there's water rolling down it, and <laughs> that's interesting. Okay, here we are back in the North River, so we're going to go down. Here. Yeah, we're going to go through Goron City. Oh yeah, I'm just going to, also going to get rid of my bottle of bugs because I don't need it anymore. So, goodbye bugs! Well, not now, I just don't need them yet. I'm going to get them later on. But yeah. Yep, the thing I need is a, something in a bottle. I need it before we go to the temple time. For a reason. Sorry bugs, but I don't need you anymore. I'm going to excuse these magic beans. Yep. But, the price for that thing is literally... A big one. I think it's about 200 rupees. Could be 300. If not, then I just have to get some more rupees and I should be able to buy it. And it's going to be useful later on in the game. I'm just giving it storage right now, but yeah. Thank you for some rupees. That's good. Yep. So let's get going. Probably not the video, but Sunday the Temple Time. Let's go. Let's go up here. So yeah, let's go to the area known as the the Dongles Cavern. Yep, the Dongles Cavern. Here we go. Owie. I didn't hurt. 
just want to do that it's really good. Let's get some hearts. And plant our last magic bean right here. Yep. You just want to do this for a reason. You wonder why later on, but right now, we gotta get our last goal to Tola, which is in the Dinosaur's Cavern. Which I forgot. Anyway, for information, it is in. I repeat. It is in the final room we haven't accessed yet. If we're gonna access that, then we're actually gonna get out of here because we gotta get to 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 our stuff we need to do. And then we have to just get out of here. We're good. So anyway. Yes, I know. We have to do the entire thing all over again. Darn it! Darn it! Darn it! Darn it! Great! That's lame. That is really lame. I keep forgetting about that shield. Come on. Really? Oh man, I gotta buy another one. Really? Ugh. This is just lame. Oh god. Good fire keys. Great. Now I have to go to the Temple of Time with the Highland Shield. That's lame. No, I wanted to throw. There we go, thank goodness. Oh my god. In here, behind the armors is the ghost of Tulla. Maybe damage it. Right there, and there we go. There it is, the final ghost of Tulla. But it's an actual armors! Oh man. Why do I keep losing my Tiger Shield? Really? Keep losing it. Oh man. I guess I'm gonna have to purchase one later on in the game. Yeah. Yeah, so you know what? New rule. When a child enters the fire part of the game, you must put on your Highland Shield. Because the fire can really hurt you a lot. And now let's just get out of here because we don't need to be here anymore. For a while though. We gotta stop wasting time and get on with the game. And let's just move on. So let's do that. Let's go to the Temple of Time. But well, first we gotta do some stuff quickly because it's been 13 minutes right now and we haven't done anything in the Temple of Time. All the new stuff we haven't done yet. So we gotta keep going. We gotta move. We gotta move. We gotta move. We got a lot of cutscenes coming up. We gotta get the thing. There's no time for the four goes to a prize. We'll get that later on. Although it is something useful later on in the game, I'm not gonna get it yet. We gotta go to the potion shop. Oh, wait, that's right, it's in. In Castle Town. Let's go. That's on this way. It's this way. Let's go. Let's go. We're gonna be late. Oh man, I have to play Sun Song twice because it's starting at late and I can't enter the place until it's later on. Let's move! Oh my god, I gotta move! I gotta move! Play Sun Song! And play it again, quickly! So it's gonna be daytime! Goodness, we gotta make it. We gotta make it. We can do it. We can do it. Almost there. There we go. Castle Town's open. Let's go. Let's go. Let's keep going. Let's move. Let's move. Let's keep moving. Let's move it. We're almost there. Almost there. Just a little bit more, and here we are. So let's just go into the potion shop, which is right here. Quickly! Alright, let's see how much the day wand is. Let's see. Blue fire is 200 rupees. Ah, oh, man. 
Well, now I have a debt of a lot of rupees, really. I have a big debt of rupees. Guess we're gonna come back to the potion shop later on in the game. Well, that's fine, really. I can come back here later in the game to get the potion shop. Yep, let's just go in here. This area hasn't discovered yet. We haven't been in this area yet. I wonder why. Hmm. What is this place anyway? I just visited. Well, this place is the Temple of Time. The place where we need to go. So here we are. Temple of Time. At last. Wow, another Triforce statue place. Mm. Wow, I wonder where they are throughout the game. Anyway, let's check it. There are three holes in the inscription here. He who owns these treasure stones. Stay on Ocarina of Time and play a song of time. That is how the inscription reads. So, all we can do is now is play the song of time. Yep. There we go. Song of time. And then, now we have to place the three... Not two, not one, but three spiritual stones. Onto the ground. Here we go. And because this is actually going to be the thing, yeah. I know this is going to be very long, but I know. I did say we're going to do it in 20 minutes. Anyway, the Triforce is glowing. And with that, that door is opening. Seriously opening. And wow, it just opened. Now in here seems to be some sort of thing. And unfortunately guys, because of this, because of the way it's so long, because I have a lot of film left. I don't have a lot of film left, but I really want to save film. So yeah. I know it goes to be very long. But yeah. I don't really have an upload. Yeah. So you know what? Next time we're going to get what's in here. In other words, what is that? We'll find out next time. So yeah. See you guys on Friday when we find it out. So yeah. Later, folks.